Okay, folks, this morning we want to talk about we are out in a situation where we have no electrical power anywhere that's close by. We'd have to pull a drop cord of at least 300 feet. This here is what we call a jumping harness. Okay, you've got your ground, you've got your neutral, and you've got your hot because your recovery tank only needs 110 volts. This disconnect has 240 volts. Let me show you. I've got my meter set up here. Zero. Okay, so we got 245 volts. So we only need one leg of the 245 volts in order to get our 110 volt current. So I'm going to do something here. One thing, one thing I want to tell you guys is do not do what I'm about to do here, which I'm going to disconnect it hot, okay? You like some electricians, you can do it, but I recommend homeowners and people that work on homes, handymen I will call, please disconnect the power. Do not do this at home. My line side on this particular case is inside. What I'm going to do is I'm actually going to take my side current. I'm going to be very careful here. And in the interest of time is the only reason I'm doing this. As a general rule in the electrical industry, we always call grounds first on, last off. So I'm going to automatically go in here and put my ground on first. That might be a good idea to put a wire net on to get your clips on. In the uh, normal disconnect, you have 240 volts. You're going to have your two grounds here. So we're just going to put both the neutral and the ground clip in. We always want to kind of tug them, make sure they're tight. And we're going to take the third clip here very carefully. clip it on. Make sure we get a good tight fit bit bite. Okay, now we should have 110 volts, which I know we do, so I'm going to take and plug it in. Now I'm just going to put my power on. Okay. That's how you save time from running a uh, drop cord two or three hundred feet. That's how you save time from borrowing power from a neighbor's house. If you have any questions, call us at 239-596-5855. Go to jonesairconditioning.com. And I want to point out again, turn the breaker off before you try this. This can be very dangerous. Please do me a favor, guys. If you like this video, please share it. Please comment and please subscribe. Thank you.